I'm Flavia Niemeyer and today let's talk about nuts in the Whole30 program. First of all, even before talking about the ones I have here, let's talk about peanuts. Peanuts, although the name makes you think that there is a nut, it's not a nut. It's a legume, all right? And it's not in the program. I honestly thought about putting some here, but I realized I don't even buy peanuts because I normally don't like them. Although a lot of people love it here, especially with the peanut butter, you know, you do the PJ sandwich. It is not in the program, so let's see how you go without peanuts for 30 days. Now, those are the nuts that are approved in the program, at least most of them, but not all nuts are created equal, all right? There are some that are really the best ones, and then some you can have in moderation, and uh, another ones that you could have in a limited amount. The best ones are the macadamia nuts, the cashew nuts, and the hazelnuts. Those are the best ones you can have during the program. And then there are the three of them, which is the Brazilian nut. Come on, I'm Brazilian, give it a chance, it's really good, okay? And then almond nuts and pistachios. Those are ones that you can have in moderation. And then in limited amount, you can have walnuts. I'm not talking about every single one of them, I'm talking about the ones I like the most. Okay? Now, how do I use them? I am brand new to liking milk. I used to hate milk when I was a baby, so I, I was only breastfed, right? So I discovered that macadamia milk, cashew milk, Brazilian nuts, and uh, almond and pistachio mix are delicious and uh, I have been doing frequently in my house now. I also add them in salads. Uh, every salad I make, I most likely will add a little bit of nuts to give you like uh, this crunchy taste and I normally like to warm them up a little bit with coconut oil. Especially when I'm making some dish that has coconut milk in it, I also like to add some nuts. Normally I do cashew nuts and I really hope you like this video. I see you in the next one. Subscribe to my channel so you get to know when I publish the next one. All right, see you. For you that stay until the end of the video, I have two cool nuts to show you. One is my favorite because it reminds me of my childhood. It is literally a mini coconut. That's how we call it in Brazil. It's from the region where I grew up and I just honestly had it almost every week in my grandma's house and it's delicious. If you have a chance to try it, don't miss it. And this next one, which I was very surprised to find in Amazon, you can actually purchase this. And it's called Baru. And Baru, it's called by the natives as the Viagra of the Savanna, all right? So it is being called also the gold of the Savanna. It's a very delicious nut, especially when it's roasted. So I'm very curious to know whether you like it. And let me know if you feel anything aphrodisiac in it. See you!